Standing here with one of the all-time greats everywhere a basketball uniform here at the College of Charleston, Anthony Johnson. And, A.J., it's uh, probably hard for you to believe this is the 15th year now of your camp. A lot of kids and other successful camp looks like. Yeah, uh, 15 years, and uh, it's a week that I, that I definitely look forward to, uh, hanging out with the kids, learning their names, and, uh, you know, watching them get better each and every day. And, you know, a lot of them are return campers, so to watch them get better, uh, you know, from year to year is something that's very special to me. Any future stars yet you're seeing? Oh, yeah, yeah. We have a lot of talent here at camp. Uh, you know, we do a good job of, of bringing in and attracting uh, some of the best uh, youth in the area. So we do have uh, a lot of future stars and uh, look forward to see uh, how their careers go. I'm sure this is a special thrill for you. Every year uh, you get a chance to come back here. You're from here, so I'm sure this is a special event for you. Yeah, uh, this is my hometown. It's great to, to come back home. Charleston is a, a very special place to me, and uh, it's just great to, to spend some time here. So I get to see my family, get to spend time here at the College of Charleston, which I've been a part of since I was 10 years old due to my older brother. So but the college is, is a very special place, and to be here in this great arena is, is something that's very special. This arena is a great place. Obviously, you didn't get a chance to play here. You guys are in the <laughs> old arena, but uh, you still get a chance to catch some games. And tell us about your career. It's always good to catch up with you. You had a remarkable career here, conference player of the year. You guys had some great teams. Yeah, uh, we had some great teams uh, in the old building. Uh, you know, it was, it was a, a great place to play because the students were right there on the court, and uh, they brought the energy uh, every home game. And, we, you know, we had a great, great crowd, as they do now uh, here at the John Crest Arena. And uh, I think uh, the College of Charleston home games is one of the best events that go on not only in Charleston but around the country. Yeah, this is a real special uh, place for basketball. And like I say, it's really kind of one of the hidden gems here of, uh, of Charleston because you come in here, I think a lot of people, the first time they come to this arena, they're shocked at how beautiful it is and how loud it gets. Yeah, uh, you know, just walking from the street, you wouldn't even really know that it is a basketball arena here. But uh, it's very special. Uh, they did a great job of, uh, you know, building a, a great facility. And, you know, uh, it's just a great place for the athletes today to kind of grow and get to play somewhere uh, that, that as great as it is. I know coaching is a big passion of yours. I know it's something that you want to try and continue doing. But uh, first, yeah, after the College of Charleston, you went to the NBA. Parts of 13 years in the NBA had a great career. Yeah, uh, you know, being one of the best players uh, in the world is something uh, that was very special to me. Uh, to, you know, to achieve that goal for 13 years, it really says a lot. And I've just been blessed by the big man upstairs. So uh, to play 13 years is something that a lot of people can't really say. But, you know, I prided myself on being one of the best 400 players in the world. Any uh, special memories you have from the NBA? Anything that really sticks out to you? First time you were signed or any big games? I know you, I know you played in the playoffs quite a bit, too. Yeah, uh, you know, making it to uh, the NBA Finals three different times, that was very special. But just uh, putting on an NBA uniform day in and day out was something that, you know, uh, felt really good to me because it's something that's earned and it's not given. So uh, just being a part of the NBA for 13 years uh, really, uh, you know, says a lot. To wrap things up, obviously coaching is something you uh, continue to do, something you want to uh, do in the future. I know you've been working with the Atlanta Hawks. What's, uh, what's the future look like for AJ? Yeah, uh, you know, just trying to break through, uh, you know, have a couple interviews lined up here in the next uh, couple of months, but you know uh, it's been a little bit more difficult than I expected. But at the same time, uh, anything is worth having is worth working for. So I'm just going to try to stay patient, work as hard as I can, and hopefully uh, opportunity will break for me. Now, do you prefer coaching at the NBA level <laughs> or the college level? Because in the college level, you get the whole recruiting aspect. Yeah, uh, you know I interviewed for the job, and it's something that uh, you know college is definitely on the radar. Uh, but I would probably have to say just being a part of the NBA the past 50 years uh, I think uh, that's where you know I, I would like to break through uh, for the most part but uh, college is definitely not something that I'm going to rule out in the future I've been uh, to a couple events uh, as far as recruiting and and been to uh, the Peace Jam and, and uh, I worked uh, the high school camp uh, with the NBA so I've been around the college game a little bit but I would have to say my preference probably is the NBA game well, we'll let you get back I know you got 200 kids here behind you at this camp I tell you I got, I got to commend you because I've never seen one man command the attention of 290 <laughs> You're doing a good job. Nah, thank you. Uh, you know, it's 15 years in the making. Uh, you know, for the most part, we just uh, try to instill discipline, uh, give them a set of rules. But at the end of the day, uh, the most important rule is to have fun. And uh, that's something that we really stress. And I think the kids really kind of gravitate to that. It's Anthony Johnson, one of the all-time greats here at the College of Charleston.